My DE guys, our time has come. The new DE kit is here. So this is our new DE kit that we built and designed on Mike's 2006 Nissan 350Z. It's an automatic 350Z. And as you can tell, it's a little bit different compared to how we had our previous DE kit that came out in 2012, 2013. That kit was very successful. However, there was a lot of things that we found that needed to be improved and also that could help with the efficiency of the kit. So the one thing you'll see is on this kit, the turbo is on the right side. On the previous kit, it used to be on the left side. Um, a lot of reasons why we did that was, number one, to shorten the intercooler piping to help with efficiency and help with spool, which it did do that. And another thing was we wanted to try to do something different. Um, doesn't make any sense to redo a kit and then have the same setup as it was before and then come out with it. So we wanted to do something different with it. With that being said, the number one question you probably ask is, okay, why is that turbo or how does that turbo fit on the right side? The way we made it work is we removed the coolant pipe on that passenger side and basically mimicked a VHR cooling system. And so you'll see we ran the coolant pipe through the middle. There's a hose that we've altered and, and uh, adjusted to allow it to work with the stock radiator. And that allows us to run the intercooler piping down the passenger side, into the intercooler, out the intercooler, and up into the driver's side. Up pipe, down pipe is very similar. We went with the, the crossover. I'll pan on the bottom side so you can see how the crossover is set up. It goes into, um, it merges into two pipes. It comes up into one one-up pipe using the Turbo Smart wastegate, a 45 size wastegate, which is more than enough to allow it to not creep and allow the, the boost to stay consistent as you'll see in the Dynagraph. So on this setup, you'll see um, that we have the crossovers that come off for the actual manifolds. It goes into the up pipe, into the turbo, and then the down pipe. And then from the down pipe, we have a piece called the down pipe to cap back adapter piece, which you'll see, I'll pan over it. That will come with the kit. So if you have any exhaust that bolts up to the actual stock Y pipe location, this kit will work with that. If you don't, let's say for example, you have a, a true dual exhaust, you will need to modify that to fits to where that component will stop, which is called the downpipe to cap back adapter piece. Turbo's on the right side, as you can see here, we used the same turbo that was used in our first DE kit, which is the GTX 3582. It is the Gen 2, so this turbo is capable of 850 horsepower. So you could make a lot of horsepower on this car as long as the motor can handle it. It's gonna be the biggest thing or the transmission. A seven pound spring that'll come automatically with every single kit. You can do a five pound spring. You can do however orientation, whatever orientation you'd like with the spring setups, assuming that you have the motor and transmission to handle that so it doesn't have any failure with that. So you can see turbo on this side, charge pipe comes down, goes around here, goes into the intercooler, and it comes out the top side of the intercooler into the throttle body. So we're using one of our Garrett cores that we've been using on our VHR uh, single turbo kits and also our V2 air to air single, our V2 air to air supercharger kits. Um, so this is the same intercooler core, same intercooler core tank configuration. So we know this intercooler core does work. Um, and so we have incorporated this into this kit. Now with the turbo being on this side, we've removed the coolant reservoir and the power steering reservoir that comes here factory. And so we've relocated it here to this, which will come with the kit and also done a power steering relocation uh, over here like we do on the VHR single turbo kits. So all these components will come inside the actual kit when you do purchase the kit. So you may ask, okay, well, if I do buy this kit, do I need anything else? The kit will come with everything that you see here to allow you to install the kits. Now, the number one question everybody's been asking, so what kind of power does this kit make? So this is an automatic, so keep this in mind, it still has the 5AT in this car, which we are all know, aware of that is not a very strong transmission. Um, so on this setup, 7.9 PSI, 384 wheel, 384 foot pounds of torque on pump 93. If you look at the power band, the power band is great. It, it comes in and it just holds, which is very uncommon for a DE kit. So keeping the torque down low is gonna be something that helps. Um, this car does also have the Transgo, the Transgo shift kit, valve body kit on this car. So that does help with the shifting and allowing it to, to have much more firmer shifts. Um, that was the only thing that we upgraded on the transmission. Um, with this kit in particular, if it is an automatic, you will get upgraded automatic transmission lines because they need to be relocated with the actual turbo kit itself. These builds are always fun. It's always fun to release a new product. Actually, this is not really a new product. It's just we've uh, redesigned this product to allow it to be more efficient. First reactions of the DE kit. It is so smooth. It's like driving an OEM car. It's like it came like this from the factory. So far, it's just, it's an absolute blast and it's comfortable. It's 
really amazes me how quiet and calm it is in like uh, normal traffic. Yeah, for sure. Um, I think people that get this kit are going to absolutely love that. You know, you can get in the car and go drive for a couple hours and be super comfortable doing it. How do you feel about the power band of the new DE kit and any feedback on the kit? So after doing a couple pulls, this thing is a little rocket. Um, not used to having that kind of power in a stock motor DE. Uh, it's, it's super quick, it's very responsive, and you know it, it gets through the gears super quick. I think, I think people are gonna absolutely love this kit, and I can't wait to start seeing them go out. Hit the button below, hit the subscribe button, and then we'll catch you on the next one.